Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we are doing a vlog video. So basically, um, this was filmed a few days ago on my day off. And yeah, I'm just going to take you through the day and show you what I did. So I'm just packing up my film gear here, which is just basically a bunch of GoPro accessories because that's what I film with, if you're wondering. And yeah, um, it's a GoPro Hero. So there's me backing up. Um, it was so beautiful out that day. The sun was shining. Like it wasn't too hot because there was a little bit of wind, but it was like perfect. Like look at the sky. And I did not color grade this footage. This is all straight from the GoPro, man. Like I love GoPro cameras. Um, so my first stop of the day, I had to go to Walmart to pick up a few things for my younger sister. And it actually wasn't too busy. As you could see, the parking lot wasn't that full. Um, I decided to stop and get something to eat. So I picked up a sub from Subway. I was watching one of Juice's videos, and I think he said he got a Chipotle uh, wrap there. So that's what I picked up. I haven't had one in a long time. I uh, can't really see it, but uh, just spinach, onions, lettuce, to, uh, tomato, extra pickles, and then he got the meat. So yeah, oh, and they grilled it. I, I love getting it grilled now, man. I don't know what it is, it's just it's so much better. And yeah, um, now I really want one. Oh yeah, check out this asshole. So I was just being nosy and looking at people. This guy in the truck left his cart in the middle of the fucking parking lot. Like, what if somebody hits that? Like, jeez, man. And then whoever works at that store has to go and get it. People that do that are not cool. Don't do that, people. Anyway, um, yeah, so just going to my sister's place right now to drop off a bunch of groceries. Not a bunch, but there's my <laughs> there's my niece. She does this every time. She runs up to me and tries to hug me. I had like a shitload of groceries in my hand. That it right there, guys, is how a man brings in the groceries. One hand. Never make two trips. Always one trip. <laughs> I just don't like walking back to the car, but. Um, my sister was telling me that, uh, she wants to take the pedals off the bike because it's too small for Jace and his knees keep hitting the, um, the thing, uh, the handlebars. So I was trying to take off the pedals here to make it like into a balanced bike and I could not get it off. I was like, man, I was fucking with that thing for a good hour. Like I was just going to start hitting it with a hammer or something, but I don't know, like that adjustable wrench was too big it wouldn't fit for some reason so um because it had to fit in like a certain spot but I've, i messed around with it for a bit and i just couldn't do it so we said fuck it um we did end up picking him up another bike and i actually just put his training wheels on it today so yeah we are sitting or i am sitting home just eating some gum that's like a big thing of gum my mom got me which is pretty cool and just kind of like thinking of what I'm going to do for the rest of the day. And I decided I was going to work out. Um, I really need to work on my cardio for boxing and like kickboxing and stuff like that. So I was like, I'm going to hit the bag. I think gyms are going to be opening back up hopefully like within the next couple months. So, you know, I'm going to get that cardio going. And yeah, so I just hit the bag for like, I don't know, like 10, 15 minutes. Man, I was out of breath. But yeah, that, uh, that's an Everlast. So it was probably bought at Sports Check, I'm thinking. Um, I got it online. I got it off Kijiji um, for like 80 bucks, I think. And they go for like 120 But he just said he didn't use it anymore and he wanted to sell it. So I was like, yeah, dude, I'll uh, come pick it up right now. And it actually fit in the car. So I thought it was a pretty good deal. And it's holding up pretty good like I fucking beat on that thing um, the base you can put like water in it or you can put uh, sand I'm gonna I'm, I don't want to put any sand because like if I ever sell it or whatever it's gonna be like what am I gonna do with all that sand and w when you hit it, it makes kind of a mess with sand same with water like water will splash out the bottom so I just put uh, two of my 40 pound weights in there. So there's 80 pounds. It still moves, but it, it it's pretty solid right now. Um, but I'm going to pick up some rock, like some, some rock and put that in there. I think that'd be good. And yeah, right here, just grabbing some more gum, getting ready to go for a jog. 
suggested that instead of steaming them, to put some oil on them and then some salt and pepper and roast them in the oven. So I decided to try it out. I've never eaten them like that. I've always either uh, boiled them or steamed them. Don't boil broccoli, guys. It's not good. Uh, steaming's better, but I used to boil it and it'd be all watery. It's fucking shit. It's like mush. But honestly, this was bomb. I'm not gonna lie. You'll see in a second. So yeah, put some salt and pepper and a little bit of oil. Put it in the oven for a bit. Oh yeah, you gotta make sure you get it all mixed up there. And yeah, I just threw it in for like, I think 20 minutes. But I never let the oven heat up. I just turn it on, throw it in. Um, because a lot of people like let it heat up to the actual temperature you set it at. Not me. Because I don't know any better, I guess. Um, decided to cook up some chicken breast, which is my favorite meat. I always get chicken breast. Um, it's a good protein. Like, but pretty much no fat on it. And yeah, I just butterfly it. Load it up with some salt and pepper. And then I just pan fry it. I put it on like really low that way it'll be like really nice and tender I don't like chewy chicken that's what happens if you cook it too fast but I used to use my um instapot but I don't know I just I haven't used it in a while I don't like cleaning it after <laughs> if I used the uh, pan mom cleans it for me so I'm a lazy fuck um it's funny because I'm not lazy when it comes to like going to work out like going to the gym and jogging and stuff like that but like when it comes to doing dishes or like doing my laundry or stuff like that I'm lazy as fuck anyways here is the um results like man I am gonna be cooking my broccoli like that from now on dude if you're watching this video shout out to you that shit was bomb as fuck and on the chicken I just put like a little bit of onion like man I didn't cook it all the way so there was still a little crunch the shit was beautiful guys you need to try it very delicious and um yeah I just kind of ate it <laughs> not much not very exciting but um when I was getting ready for my fights that's pretty much all I would eat would be broccoli and chicken like that would be my diet and I lost so much weight and I made weight and I was actually underweight um yeah, that's pretty much what I'd eat. And apples. Carrots, too. So I was actually watching a live of Jews while I was driving to go pick up my mom. I was more listening to it than watching it, but it was dope, man. Fuck, we had all the players in there today. We had Jews. We had Suave Boom. Uh, we had Juicy Dingles. Like, it's just all old school ASMR artists that I used to watch. So I was like, yo, I am not missing this. I'm putting you up there. I'm fucking driving. <laughs> And that's pretty much it for my day. I just went to go pick up mom and just headed home. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys next time.